for the first pose, we're going to go into a light seal stretch. Now try to grab onto one of your legs. Now grab onto the other leg. For the next stretch, we're going to do a bow pose, so feel free to grab onto your legs and if you can't, just go into your seal stretch. Now you can try to get your hands to go overhead to get an even deeper stretch or if you can't that's okay you can just do your seal stretch as the beginner version. Now arch back in as deep of a seal stretch as you can. Relax your back a little bit after that stretch and go into a child's pose. For the next pose we're going to be doing a cat-cow stretch so arch back and forth. Now stay arched back so you get an even deeper stretch. We're going to do some backwards kicks to warm up your legs since we're going to move on to leg stretches. Now let's switch sides. Now go on your knees and slowly arch back to get a deep stretch in your back.
Now go into a child's pose. Now you can slowly lie down on your back and grab onto your ankles and push up your hips to get a deep stretch in your back. Now lie down on your stomach because we're going to do some superman pull-ups. Now try to hold your hands and legs up. For this next stretch you can stand up or you can just try to go into a bridge the normal way because we're going to do a back bend and if you're flexible and if you can try to grab onto your ankles to do a teardrop. For the next stretch, put your hand up and try to get your other hand to grab onto your elbow and push your hand down as far as you can to get a deep shoulder stretch. We're going to repeat that stretch on your other side. For this next stretch, try to interlock your fingers behind your back to get a deep shoulder stretch. Now repeat that same stretch with your arms on the opposite sides.
Now we're going to move on to leg stretches. For the first stretch, we're going to do a sitting pike stretch with your legs straight and your feet pointed. Now to get an even deeper stretch, try to flex your feet. Now we're going to go into a forwards lunge. This should help you get a very deep stretch in the back leg. If you want to, you can try to grab onto your back leg to get an even deeper stretch. Now go into a forwards lunge with your feet pointed. Now you can slowly start to sink in into a split. It's totally okay if you can't do a full split, just go as far as you can. If you want to, you can even try to arch back. You can now slowly get out of your split because we're going to repeat all the stretches we just did on your other leg starting with the forwards lunge. If you want to, you can now arch your back leg. Now you can slowly go into your backwards lunge.
Well done for making it this far into the routine and for our last stretch we're going to go into a split and you can even arch back if you want to. Great job for completing this whole routine and hope to see you back here tomorrow.